right, we'll get started. Uh, we've got seven, eight, and let's see, today's Tuesday. On um, today is Tuesday, so I've got back and and um, back and biceps today. So we're going to start with uh, two arm double um, deadlift to bend over row. So you hinge, hinge forward in that deadlift row and come back upright, squeezing your shoulder blades together. Together. Then we've got a side lunge up for a curl. We've got a supine uh, extended arm kickback. So you'll take those lighter weights with you to the mat, lay out on your belly. You're going to lift your torso up and then squeeze those shoulder blades together and lift those hands up um, over your hip area. Then we've got side planks with the knee up. Then we've got uh, bent over rows on our feet. Then we've got donkey kicks with a band, so loop band around your knees on all fours. Then overhead tricep dips here. And then we'll end with curl press. Okay, so standing curl press. All right, so first thing's going to be that deadlift. Um, with bent over rows, grab your heavier dumbbells for that set. Get our timer started. Oops. Everybody ready? Okay. Get get going. that set to give us a warning countdown, but I must have hit something wrong because obviously that didn't work. Go. two columns of peel and stick wallpaper now stuck to my office wall. Great. But it's so cool. It was super easy. I had to wrestle a little bit, but uh, super easy. You got the two ones up. Great. Or go, oh, sorry. You got uh, two sheets up already. Matched the little chevron uh, print. This is cute. I'll post a picture when I'm done. Break. We moved our house was a new construction and clearly like very spec home like yeah. So all the walls are beige, and that's fine. You know, we made it move in ready for sure. But it's fun like at giving some actual personality to the walls. Set those aside. We'll have our cardio set next. So this is high knees to a side hop. So two or three hops or two or three high knees.
Good work. If you haven't seen the, uh, let's see, when Nadecki got second place to the Australian, if you haven't watched the Australian swim coach's reaction yet, please find that online. So funny. My kids are cracking up at it last night. He does deserve. All right, jumping jacks. Come on. We watched a little diving last night. Just six to ten inches off 
the ground. Whew. Deep breaths. Keep it up, good work. Kick, kick in. Ten. All right, bend those knees. You've got penguins. Skinning those heels side to side. We thought we were so clever at work. We had um, a couple of, like soda cans. This has happened. I guess it probably happens over the weekend. Now that I think about it, and on Monday you come in, they've you know they've frozen, so the tops are like domed out. So yesterday I pulled them out and break. All right, we've got those too high. We've extended arm kickbacks now, so flat on your stomach, either body weight or just. A light hand weight. You're pressing those. Your hands start out at your side, lift your torso, and then squeeze those shoulder blades together. And lift those hands, maybe a, maybe a foot off the mat. Anyway, we thought we were so clever. These couple hands break. Since this has happened a few times, I said, well, um, here we go. Go. I said, well, we should just be careful not to put them back there because that's where they're freezing. Um, and the other one said, yeah, we should put something back there to kind of block the space so we don't shove soda cans back there and whatever and then have it explode. So I said, okay, I'll take empty cans, duct tape the tops and stick them back there and that way, you know, we'll prevent this problem and then our the director boss came over and I explained our MacGyver solution. And he goes, or you can just turn the refrigerator down. So yeah, that was a, that took an expert. We thought we were pretty clever. Great. Common sense, you know, not always common. Here we go, lift and press, go. Hold that torso up, squeeze those shoulder blades. Nice deep breaths here, get you through it. Great. All right, curl over. 
You're on your back, feet are up in the air. The toe taps. Whew. Okay, that one made me sweat, I think. Hard stuff. Good job. knees. Heels are hovering above the ground, alternate tap down. Good work. Go. 
slowly start to flip over for butterfly sit up so feet together, knees apart. So, If you're thinking of getting a new mat, this is just the Amazon like opening price point special. And I do like it because it's thicker, it's a half inch. So it has some, some actual pads to it as opposed to a lot of yoga mats. It's a little bit narrower than traditional yoga mat, I think, but that usually doesn't matter for our purposes. Elbow and knee, crank those feet. Keep it up. Seconds. No, that's not right. Sorry, 15 seconds. You can probably see the clock better than I can. Almost there. Whew. Great. Good work. We are all back on our feet for bed over ropes. You're going to start with your palms facing away from your body on these. As your elbows skim your sides, your palms are gonna stay away from pointing the same direction as your toes. Remember to think about your lower body stance there so that you're protecting your spine. You should hinge forward not slouch forward and not roll your spine forward. Get your palms facing out again. Great. We'll rotate our hands down. Palms are going to be facing each other. Two more sets and forward go. Break. All right, one more palm facing together. And then we'll rotate our hands one more time. Here we go. Go. Great. All right, last two rounds. So rotate those hands so they're that your palms are facing behind you. Go. Naturally, but here your elbows do come up to the sides on these as your palms face back. Go. 
usually on roads, I'm telling you to keep your elbows against your side here. They're gonna naturally push out the side. So our body should be very engaged and core. Great. Whew. All right, set those weights aside. Our cardio work is going to be high knees. Go. up. Last cardio set. Second minute is going to be a standing broad jump with a back pedal. Okay, so whatever space you've got. I don't have much. Standing broad jump, back pedal, back to position. So 
switch sides. Let's pulse the other leg. Here we go. Go. Keep breathing. Get my piano out of the workout room and into my 
upstairs living room. So if you're a praying kind, you can pray it doesn't come back to the ceiling. They assure me it should be fine once they get it there. Oh, great. Last one. <laughs> I know, I know your arms are shot. I do that. Ooh, keep those elbows pressed towards your ears though. I know they want to pop out. Great, good work. All right, standing obliques, we're gonna start just to one side, grab a heavier weight. Go. I feel like it's a real uh, like health influencer win that I've really switched over a lot of the office. Like we've gotten away from a lot of the sodas that were in there and now it's all full of bubblies and LaCroix and water bottles. So I feel like that's a little victory. I have a room set up that it's um, so it's like a small conference room or small meeting room, but and there, so there's a like glass window in it, but we covered it with cardboard. So if you want to go grab an hour of you know yoga midday or something, I was trying to encourage that thing, but. I think one person took me up on it one time and that was it. So maybe New Year's resolutions will bring some. And I had I had a new woman starting in the middle of August. She seemed she seemed excited about that possibility of using that space. So maybe someone will. It's not too hard to find to open office space right now though. We don't have everybody back. It's pretty quiet. All right, curls to shoulder overhead press. Mm. Go. Whew. So turn those palms out as you lower them for a rise up curl and then twist them around. Face away from your body for that overhead press. Great. Go. Great. I don't know if you both saw, I added that Saturday or Friday class. Go. Yeah. The Friday at 5.45 is a switch. So I know the later times are too late for you guys, so I don't know if you want to join Friday or not. So it's, yeah, it's an option now. Six forty classes have me roll in too late to work too, so I figured I'd keep it break. I figured I'd keep that to just one day a week. As late as that gets you there on Wednesday. So. Round four. Two more. 
down. Go.